old dirt road has its second homestead in the works. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. Today, we have a special video because we have some special guests. Old Dirt Road has its second homestead in the works. If you followed us from the beginning, you heard us talk about my boys who are in Florida. Um, we had purchased the property with our three older sons and two of them are still in Florida. One of them is here. Um, and they came up for Thanksgiving. It was a very special Thanksgiving. And now they're working on their part of the land, getting it ready picking out the perfect view, figuring out where they want to place their home. So let's go take a look. Now, if you've been with us since the beginning and you saw our day one video, we showed portions of the property. And the one we're going up now is Bear's property. It's the highest point of the whole property. We call it the circle. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Thank you for coming by and checking us out. You can view that video, it's our first one. We have drone footage and this is pretty much where we started with the first day. You can see the trees are coming down there's a lot of work to do. There's always some standing water right here in the driveway going up. But they've been working hard, trying to uh, make some good progress. See the pine trees. And trying to get up to the top. Joshua is Cutting the brush. We have so many brambles. And he's just cleaning that all out. Planted pines on both, both sides of the little roadway here. And they're really, really expanding this circle. It really looks beautiful. Look at that view. Sean and I had thought about this spot when we were all trying to decide who wanted what, when we divided everything up. And words and the camera can't even show you just how beautiful it is up here. That is where the sun sets, and we get some beautiful sunsets here. So I'm walking over to where, um, I hope you guys can hear me, but I'm walking over to where it's going to overlook. The plan is to take down a lot of these pines that are blocking that view. Right there, it drops down. So, Bear is going to overlook Joshua's property. Let's go say hello. everybody this is my baby boy what up joshua he's just cutting using, some brambles and yep. tall grass with this uh 
Sweetie D, get the attachments really sharp, gets it real good, gets in all the thick stuff. Yeah, Trying they just got that. to clear a lot that. of this stuff out, clean it up a little bit. And do you want to tell them kind of where does this go? There's this little pathway so we can get in here easier, but before when uh, Bear was over here, he was clearing it with the, the uh, skid steer. Yeah, the skid steer. And it all grew back when we, came, when we got back here. So we're just trying to clean it up a little bit by hand as best we can. He's over there. He's got the chainsaw and yep. everything. We're going to meet Bear. He's a little yep. camera shy, but we're going to get him up <laughs> on here. And where does this pathway lead to? Joshy? This leads to, we cleared some stuff. We haven't finished over there, but it just, it's a little pathway we cleared so we can get in there easier to get to the trees and all that. Yeah, but where does this lead to? Where does it overlook? The, it overlooks the horizon and, and for the sunset. Right, but it overlooks your land. Yeah, it overlooks my land, <laughs> Sean Jr.'s land. Yep. So you excited? Yeah. You love the property? Yeah, the property's great. Love it. Yep. Sweet property, almost 50 acres. I got 10. Bear's got like 12.8. Sean Jr.'s got 12.8. A lot so of work there you by have hand, it. Though. Yes, it is. It's a lot of work to do by hand, but we're doing it little yep. by little, aren't we? Mm -hmm. So there you have it. You met Joshy. Yeah, we're doing it. We're trying to get it done, but a lot of work by hand. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. You met Joshua, here's Bear. He's the one that owns the circle, the highest point of the whole property. Say hello. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> and do you wanna tell him a little bit about your vision you're seeing? Uh, right now we're just playing out all this land here, all these trees, so I can get a nice uh, view of the horizon, the sunset, and the trees in the background. Other than that, and, and then he can overlook his his baby brother's property <laughs> at the yeah. same time. And yeah. do you want to kind of like, you know, tell them where you're thinking about placing your house? Let's uh, kind of we're kind of they're still cleaning and clearing. So excuse me for bouncing you around. I'm trying not to step in some of the brambles that catch you on your clothing. <laughs> so let's see. So you want to give your thoughts on this property? Thoughts when we uh, first talked to you about it and the first time you saw it? And uh, I mean, it's a big property. It's going to take a lot of work, but... You excited? Yeah, we're excited to get down and get the hard work going and get it cleared. So uh, after, after this time coming up, uh, are you going to make some more trips to do some more work? Yeah, we're gonna have to make more trips, uh, maybe get a tractor, you know. <laughs> yeah, Got the four wheeler on the way, hopefully. So as I came walking back down, it got me thinking. I just wanted to give you guys a better look. 
because there's no better place to ask than people that might have experience with this. Um, if you have any suggestions of what we, you know, what the boys might be able to do to prevent, I mean, this water is usually standing year round. I don't, I don't know if the rain is slipping down into it or what's going on, but we would love to hear your thoughts on what we could do to keep this from happening. Whether it's bringing in dirt or if you think a culvert, if you have experience with this, please put that down in the comments and um, give us some ideas of what to do with this. We'd appreciate it. So there you have it. You met both boys. They leave in two days, but we're hopeful they're gonna be back soon because they know they've got a lot of stuff to get going on. <laughs> for their little homesteads. Yep. So we appreciate you joining and watching this. Um, if you're new to the channel, please hit the like button. We appreciate you. Thank you to everyone that stuck by us. Have a great day, guys.